hello guys and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to do a fun hairstyle that i saw if you're new here welcome if you've made this your home thank you for coming back so today i am going to do a fun hairstyle with elastics i will uh, show you the picture right here of the style that i'm trying to achieve or at least that is inspiring me so i have already partitioned my hair i washed it um straightened it and now i'm going to do the hairband cornrows so if you're gonna try this i think to save time it's better to do all the partitions before you even start that way um you don't get tired trying to get those lines straight is like a pain but if you do it like all together and maybe take a break and then come back and just like start doing this i think it will be much more enjoyable or you can go ahead and uh, do the little ones as well. I was wrong. I did not fully detangle my hair and um, it took me a while to like, you know, partition these smaller ones. But I don't mind because I did not want to strain my hair just to get this style. So I'm just gonna... It's a fun style. It doesn't need to hurt or like take a lot. If you want, you can use gel to lay your edges, but I'm not a fan of gel. So I just do this as it is. I'm using two elastic bands at the same time. Like that, and then you are going to join it with the second one. And be careful when you're doing the back one, the last one, Make sure to make it loose so that like you are not pulling on hair when you bend your head. I'm not going to add any extensions to my hair. I'm going to just twist my own hair as it is. And in loose twists because I want it to look fluffy. Guys, I'm sorry for the lighting today. It's a mess, but I'm going to figure it out. If not today, for the next video, I'm going to be like A1. Okay? I feel like I've caught on to too much hair, so I'm gonna break this one and start afresh. See, I was starting to pick hair from this other side, so I'm gonna have to restrain this one. Keep it intact. Sure if you use gel, it will be fine, but like I said, I don't like using gel on my hair because it means I have to wash it sooner than I, I need to. I'm going to try to do this other one separate before I join them together. So I did go ahead and partition everything so I'm going to like join this to that and to that like that I figured that will look better This one I left it at the middle, it didn't go all the way to the back because I'm gonna join it with this one. And this time I don't have to make it like too tight when I'm, I'm uh, whatever, because I already like individually held everything together. It's already neat, so I just need to join them. So I take this one to this one. just join them without tightening it make sure you're not bringing in any hairs from the other bundles
once I've gotten to like where the hair is like a lot, I actually uh, twist it like that so that it's not like all over the place. I'm loving it. This looks really amazing. I love it. Like really love it. And if I had detangled my hair before all these, this would have taken like a very short time. I feel like the what takes the longest time is like you know making the sectioning and trying to make them perfect, you know. And you're the you're a one man job. This is where I'm going to hold this line and this line and join them with this one. Right. That's gonna need. It's gonna be like bulky, but it's fine. Yeah, so I just twisted that. And then right here at the end, I'm just gonna make a twist. So guys that's the style of the day it turned out great this is a very easy style to do say if you were going to an event or an occasion and it's like the night before you don't know what to do but you don't really need to look like really good this is a style you can do for my sisters with like relaxed hair this will be like really really easy for you and for those of us with like natural kinky hair it takes a little bit more work but then the outcome is like really beautiful so it's really worth it
yeah so i know some of you are gonna be in the comments like i should not use elastic bands on my hair but this is this is a style to last you a day or two plus the elastic the elastic is usually very sensitive to oils it breaks so even as i was doing this a few of the elastics have actually broken while i was doing that i don't know i think these were the cheaper type of elastics that i had lying around in the house so i'm sure there's better quality ones but uh, you can always you can always oil your elastics if it's like the good quality elastics that don't break you can oil them and it does it doesn't tug on your hair or anything like that so i believe it's a safe style it's a safe quick safe quick and efficient time a little time consuming for natural hair but it's all worth it uh, i'm highly impressed i'm stunned i'm sold i'll do this again but before i do this again there's another style that i have to do that is similar to this which would actually last longer so uh the next video after this is going to be that so be on the lookout i'm sure it will be suggested to you i feel like talking a lot today but i don't i don't have anything else to say so thank you guys thank you for watching this far and if you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up give me a comment and let me know how you find this if you have ever tried this and if you have um if you know of elastic bands that actually don't break as fast as the cheaper ones that i used please let me know in the comments because i would love to have i would love to use that um at some point the next time i do this i'd like to i'd love to use that so yeah thank you very much comment subscribe and see you next time